David Bay here for MuscularDevelopment.com. We are in Pittsburgh for the 2015 North American Championships, and I am here with your over 35 overall winner and new IFBB pro, Sean Harris. Sean, you've been after it for a while, man. How does it feel to finally have that pro card? Feels great. I'm I'm thrilled. I, I just I can can't be, can't put it into words. I'm thrilled. <laughs> All right. Now a close finish last year. Got second at Team U. Just missed your pro card last year, and a close uh, the the open here. Um, you know, for you guys that have been following along, you got second in the open, and that was as close of an open as I think it could possibly be. It came down to literally a pose for pose uh, with you and Gerald. Um, you know, Gerald uh, taking uh, you know taking that pro card in the open. You're still walking away as an IFBB pro. Um, you know. Talk to us what you've been up to, uh, you know, over the last, you know, not just over the last year or so. I remember seeing you on stage in 2007 against a friend of mine, Chad LeCount, at, at Nationals. You look fantastic then. You know, give us a quick rundown of what you've been doing, you know, before uh, before you're getting your pro card here. Uh, you know, life's been busy. You know, it's uh, bodybuilding's a passion and uh, it's my lifestyle. But I also have, uh, you know, two careers. Uh, I have a wife and two kids. Uh so it's uh, I got to find that balance between bodybuilding and competing. So it's hard for me to hit two or three national shows in a year. So uh, you know I, I've been teaching for 17 years. I'm a phys ed teacher in a high school. I run a personal training business and I'm a prep coach. Uh, so you know between handling all the clients and work and the family life, uh, it, it gets busy. And I had to take some time off to do things I had to do for a few years and. Went back to the Team U in 2014, took second, uh, and came back to North Americans this year and, uh, you know, got that pro card. Now, being a, a high school phys ed teacher, do the kids think it's pretty cool having a having a teacher that's all buff? Because my I had I had one I should say I shouldn't say I had one gym teacher in high school. He was in pretty good shape, lifted a little bit crazy, but he was a really good guy. But uh, I mean, the kids must think that's pretty cool. Yeah, the, the, most of them do. Uh, I get along great with the kids because of the bodybuilding and, and the weightlifting and whatnot. I'm lucky I actually teach four weight training classes a day and one health class. So I tell them, I said, listen, I said. You know, normally I charge a lot of money for this stuff. I said, so you're getting it for free. Try to try to appreciate it and, and get what you can out of me. But uh, yeah, I get along great with them, and uh, you know, it's 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 great. All right, now, man, I, I I talk to everybody after their wins, and I want to let everybody enjoy their victories, but. You're a new IFBB pro now, uh, and, and you know one of the things we talk about. And I talked about this with with uh, Mitch Stats earlier on. When we talked about his overall win. Is that uh, you know so many guys talk about you know back in the day when people turned pro, they were ready for the pros, and there there didn't need to be this you know a year off, two years off, three years off. And talking with Steve Weinberger and talking with some of the other people, the general consensus, as with Mitch in the Open, is that Sean Harris is pretty much ready for a pro stage. I mean, is that something that you're looking at? I mean, I know. In 2015, we have uh, we have the Phoenix Europa, we have the Lufrigno Classic, but uh, and then obviously a handful of shows in 2016. I mean, can we look forward to seeing you on stage sometime later this year or next year? Uh, possibly. You know, bodybuilding's in my blood. Uh, it's you know, I, I just love to do it. Uh, do I think I need more improvements and changes? And so, of course, uh, you know, if I had to choose, my first choice of shows would be the New York Pro. It's my hometown. Backyard, man. It's my, you know, I, I'd love to have you know everybody I come that I know support me there and, and see me compete there. It'd be great. But we'll see what happens. I want to definitely put on a little bit of size and see what I can do in the next few months. All right. Well, the New York Pro, one of the best shows on the IFBB circuit. Anybody who's been there knows how much the fans in New York love bodybuilding in general. But they really love their New York guys, their ones, their victors. Uh, yeah. So I'm sure they'd be really happy to see you jump on stage. But once again, for right now, we're going to just let you enjoy this victory. Any shout outs, any thank yous, yeah, or anything before you go? Shout out to some people. Uh, you know, my family, like I said, I have a wife and two kids. Uh, I just got off the phone with my kids, and they were congratulating me. First thing, uh, I, uh, I brought this guy out. We walked out from backstage. First thing, he walks out from backstage. Bunch of cheers. Wife hands him the phone. It's his kids on the phone saying congratulations. A cool moment, uh, obviously for you. But even as a media guy, it was it was pretty cool to see. I, I I'll let you back to you. I'm sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean, I didn't mean to cut you off. But it was a cool moment to see, man. I, I wish my kids could have been here. They started their first two days of school, uh, and it's more important for them to be there. So uh, it was it's a good feeling to take a win and get on the phone with them. Uh, but definitely got to thank them. Uh, I'll have a lot of supporters from friends. Uh, and clients, uh, some clients uh, drove down here, uh, you know, made the trip to, uh, to see me and support me. Uh, I want to thank Eric Goldfarb and John Selekis. Uh, 
I do uh, most of the prep myself. I did the first 17 weeks on my own uh, uh, and kind of shooting off of their eye and making some changes, you know, as need be. Uh, but, you know, we all get a little crazy as the, the contest gets closer and right. it's very hard to guide yourself, you know. Uh, so I uh, got in touch with FAC, who happens to be a, f a friend of mine. And I want to give a big shout out to FAC uh, for keeping a close eye on me the last three weeks. And we really went step by step into the show. Uh, he's a super guy. He's a class. He's a class act, and he's a real gentleman. And I want to give a big shout out to him. And thank you for the help. I appreciate it. All right, man. Well, guys, that's going to do it for us. So once again, congratulations for myself, and everybody at MuscularDevelopment.com. Guys, this is David Bay and your new IFBB Pro, Sean Harris, from the 2015 NPC and IFBB North Americans for MuscularDevelopment.com.